Well, hello, you guys. I'm going to show you guys how to make a leotard, half sleeves, the pants, and these will be the half sleeves that connects. You know, when you put it together, they're going to connect just like this. They'll be half sleeves, and then we're going to make the pants. So let me show you the shape. Y'all see this shape? This is the shape that you will need to make your leotard. You'll put it on a fold. So if you see this pattern right here that I got. So I'm just going to pretty much fold it about right here. So you see that? And then I'm going to put in the curve when I get to my hips and go like that. And you do have to do your measurements. So I'm going to try to turn it this way. And I'm about to make this pattern. Okay, so we're going to put this on the fold. And of course, I want you to use your measurements. So when you put that on the fold with your measurements, I'm going to trace it out. And then I'm going to cut it out. Right here where the hip extended for the hip. And you do your measurements when you get to the hips and then you make it. And you can make it the panty size the way you want it. So this is the shape you'll wind up with. That's the shape you'll wind up with. Find some scissors. And we'll cut it out. across the top so you'll wind up with a shape like this y'all see that that's how it should look but it'll be your measurements that's how the shape will look so that's how we wind up getting this piece for the little top see that's that shape and then the sleeves is simple when I do the sleeves, I always take it from this shape right here, guys. I measure from here to there, and I make it as long as I want, and then these is going to be wide at the end. Then I make it wide at the end. So this is how the shirt is going to be on this little tie. So when y'all doing the measurements from where you want it to stop at to down in between your legs, make room because you don't want it to fall too short. And then the spandex, you want it to go right to left, not up and down. Some spandex have four way and you'd be perfect. But if not, you want the spandex to go right to left. So this part, you make it longer. So when you pull it up in between your crotch, it'll fit and you'll be comfortable. You won't have that pulling where it's, it's too tight. So make sure you do that. And then simply, boom, there, there is the sleeves. You'll connect it and it'll be these half sleeves. Boom. Okay? And then the final piece will be you take a pair of leggings that fits you and you trace out your leggings. Okay? So I traced out my leggings and I made them high-waisted because a lot of times you, when you make your pants short, you ever sit down and then your butt is kind of hanging out a little bit. So I would encourage you to cut them a little longer at the top. You can always take it away because the last thing you want to do is when you're sitting down, the pants is rolling down. So these are going to be the pants that's going to go on top of this. Okay? And then the final thing that I did down at the bottom. <laughs> Excuse me. <coughs> I cut two circles. So it's going to go at the bottom. I'm sorry, guys. I got to cough again. 